Thank you for joining me in the History of Science collections of the University of Oklahoma Libraries. Let's look at two treasures from the vault that throw light on the story of Hellenistic medicine. This work by Mercurialis is the first edition of Hippocrates. Mercurialis was a leading Italian physician of the 16th century. In this critical edition, he collected the various Greek texts of the Hippocratic corpus and published them in Greek with parallel Latin translations. Hippocrates is famous for many aphorisms, including, life is short, the craft is long. The Hippocratic corpus was written by many authors over a long period of time. The title page reveals various scenes representing the practice of ancient medicine. At the bottom center, we have Galen and Hippocrates. Hippocrates' successor, Herophilus of Chalcedon, is remembered for naming many anatomical parts and for describing three parallel systems of vessels, the arteries, the veins, and the nerves. Herophilus traced the connections between the nerves, the spinal cord, and the brain. He distinguished sensory and motor nerves and distinguished the dura mater and the pia mater membranes surrounding the brain. Mercurialis, the editor of Hippocrates, also published this art of gymnastics, a reconstruction of ancient sports. The art of gymnastics reflects the Hippocratic emphasis on diet and exercise and on the promotion of health as much or more than the treatment of acute disease. If you work in preventive medicine, sports medicine, or health or wellness activities, then count yourself in the Hippocratic tradition. Science is a story. What stories do you want to hear and tell about Hellenistic medicine?